Let's face it, the idea of long ages does not come from the Bible. The reason people believe in long ages is because they think the science demands it. What about the science, they ask? Isn't it anti-intellectual to reject the science? But we need to start with a powerful worldview question, and it's this. How do you know? Just because a worldview expresses itself in the language of science, that does not automatically make it scientific. And just because it can explain many things, that does not make it true. But like Freudianism and eugenics in previous times, the molecules to man evolution story has reached the status of mainstream science. So people try to integrate it with the Bible's story of life. But stories of life are framework stories because they provide the framework that all the other stories fit into and are interpreted by. Sometimes this framework is described as a worldview lens because it determines the way you look at the world around you. Like spectacles with colored lenses, they affect what we see and how we see it. Depending on the color of the lens, some things may be seen more easily, other things may be distorted, while some things may even be completely filtered out and not seen at all. Because worldviews function in this way, changing the color of the lens, i.e. the worldview, changes the way we look at the world and the stories of our world. As Christians, we know that God delights in those who tremble at his word, Isaiah 66 too. Surely then, we should have enough respect for God's word to at least consider the scientific data from the Bible's perspective as well as the world's perspective. <laughs>